Okay, Rock, um, we're here atop the Stratton Mountain Fire Tower. We just climbed up that. If you look down there, that's my pack's down there somewhere. But anyway, um, this is facing west. It says that's Mount Equinox off in the distance. You can see the ski slopes there, that mountain. I'm guessing that's uh, Killington. Uh, Stratton has a big ski area as well, but I think it's on the other side of the mountain. Or maybe it's over there where all that stuff is. And uh, we're at the fire tower. So we are at the peak of the mountain. Um, of course, we're facing south here. Uh, Mount Greylock's down there somewhere we were in Massachusetts. Uh, there's east. Um, and then of course, facing north anyway we just hit the top um it is uh thursday the 8th of august 2 53 p.m we're gonna probably go about another uh 12 miles and uh camp really close to the road uh, which goes into manchester center uh new hampshire uh the reason i'm going to camp close to that road is i want to take a nero tomorrow uh i need to resupply and i need to get a just a bunch of stuff and eat some food i'm kind of low on food right now so the next Next uh, 24 hours or so, we'll be kind of just eating a couple tortillas and some cheese. But anyway, just check out that view. It's beautiful. It's really windy up here. Um, kind of a little bit rainy, slightly. Uh, still warm enough, though, to be wearing the basketball jerseys. And there's, that must be Manchester Center down there. Uh, like I said, we're probably about 15 miles from it and about 12 miles from where we're going to camp. So it's a pretty good sized town. Uh, the town serves Killington and Stratton, so all the tourists and all the skiers come up there and then they'll, they'll stay in Manchester Center. It's kind of the center. So it's kind of a real nice hoity-toity kind of town. Uh, I'm sure my resupply will not be cheap, but that's okay. All right, love you. Take care. And that, of course, is, I, I don't know if that's the Hoosick River or one of the lakes. I don't know. It's beautiful, though. Gorgeous up here. And you can hear the wind howling. So we're going to head back down, and I'll even show you a little bit of that. As we go down, if you have a fear of heights, you probably don't want to hike the Appalachian Trail or at least take the uh, fire towers. I don't really have a fear of heights. So here we are out in the wind. There's a little hut right there that I passed. Another hiker coming up. And we're up above the tree line, of course, because we're up here in the tower. Pretty sweet. Love you. Bye.